This is the newly completed modular refinery constructed by Walter Smith Petroman Oil Limited, located in Ibigwe community in Ohaji Agbema local government area of Imo State. According to the management of Walter Smith, this refinery, which was completed in record time, is expected to produce 5,000 barrels of oil per day and 271 million litres of petroleum products, including diesel, kerosene, PMS, aviation fuel and LPG, which is just the first phase of the project, while in the second phase, the facility will target the production of 25,000 barrels of oil per day. By doing this process, we're going to add value by creating jobs, employment for a lot of people, you know, skills acquisition, you know, contribution to the economic, overall economic development and, and GDP growth. When we go into petrochemicals, and we go... The managing director and CEO of Walter Smith Petroman Oil Limited, Chike Zienwosu, says a side job creation for the host community. The impact on the immediate community will be enormous, especially when the Walter Smith goes into petrochemicals. The jobs it will create, because the upstream business that we started doesn't create that many jobs, but the downstream business creates multiples of jobs. And we've seen that even in the construction phase, where the number of jobs that were created, this entire outside battery limit was built specifically by Nigerians. There's a company that was running it, but the hands that were doing this were Nigerian, both skilled and unskilled labor. Meanwhile, the leader of the team from the Nigeria National Petroleum Corporation, Mr. Yusuf Usman, who is the chief operating officer of gas and power, commends Walter Smith for this laudable project. If we are in a position to reflect this kind of activity, it means uh, we can reach self-sufficiency in terms of uh, processing uh, petroleum uh, crude oil uh, and create uh, the products and safe foreign exchange from importation. According to the Walter Smith management, the official launch of this facility is expected to come up later in October and no doubt when operations at this modular refinery start fully, access to affordable petroleum products for people in the southeast will be made easier and faster. Thank <music> you.